We have a new apprentice vet join the practice in the form of Richard Carmody from the books, played wonderfully by James Anthony Rose. Richard Carmody is a new veterinary student who's come to Darby. Um, he's very bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. He comes highly recommended. Top scholar in his year, by all accounts. James thinks it's a brilliant idea to get a young whippersnapper in, young vet, that he can take under his wing and, and, <laughs> and show him the ropes. Uh, and he'll be a mini-me. He'll be a mini-James, and it's going to be absolutely fantastic. Richard Carmody from London. He won't last. Siegfried, who's, as you know, not particularly uh, kind to new assistants and indeed tried to sack James after 24 hours. It's a pleasure, sir. But to everyone's surprise, Siegfried and Richard get on terribly well. He turns out to be a mini Siegfried. And they end up getting on like a house on fire, finishing each other's sentences, and James feels left to the side. Uh, it really doesn't go to plan at all for him. Uh, and he ends up almost the butt of the jokes. Last one's the man as a rotten egg. Why did I become Tristan? I like about Helen is her sort of emotional intelligence, really. When she first meets him, she's really just watching and kind of observing how he is. And I think she sees that maybe he struggles with the sort of social situations and the nuance of certain situations as well, which is his charm. So um, yeah, there's new, fresh, interesting dynamics with that. Will you stop for supper? Rather rock to catch up on, I'm afraid. Alan, I'll set your place anyway, just in case. He's a very sweet young man who seems to know what he thinks about things, but uh, needs a little nurturing, a little bringing around, a little bit of... Um, learning how to understand people and their affection for animals. Do you always treat your animals like people? Richard is a little bit too sure of himself, perhaps. The animals are the easy part, of course. It's the people who cause all the bother. He has to uh, um, be taken down a peg or two and um, be put through his paces. Reducing her exposure to allergens has decreased the chronic inflammation of the lungs. That means she's on the left. Secret cuts Carmody much more slack than he did James or possibly anybody. And so Carmody is allowed to lose a little bit of his book learning. It's like change of plan. I really hit the ground running, do a lot of my big scenes quite early on. But everybody was so welcoming and nurturing and, and encouraging. And it's, it's just great fun to be a part of.